guys, it's me, Captain Everything Fun, and welcome back to another Monday Mind Day, where today we're going to be pouring natural disasters out of buckets and using that to destroy our Minecraft world. Now, we might not want to bring uh, Dr. Edward Jr. II or Milo Jr. into this one, onto the video. <laughs> so, Dr. Edward Jr. is second, actually, well, he told me yesterday that he was going to do something. I can't remember. I'm so tired. It might have been about this new anvil that he's installed. I don't know. I need to wake myself up before we go any further. All right, that's better. <laughs> I wish you could just wake yourself up like that. <laughs> Anyways, let's see what Dr. Edward Jr. the second has. Yeah, um, gold nugget. That means teleportation nugget. Uh, which means he's gonna take us to some really fun, fun place that can't physically be brought in here because it's like a, a location, not an item, right? Uh, I guess not. Natural disaster buckets. And yep, this is indeed a teleportation nugget. Um, that doesn't sound very friendly. <laughs> Hi, Captain Everything Fun. I think that this may be the most dangerous experiment yet. Right up there with nuclear weapons. Oh no. I made natural disaster buckets. <laughs> Dr. Redworth Jr. in a second, can't you just invent like a unicorn or something next time? Why do you have to be messing with dangerous stuff? Same deal as the Infinity Stones, they are way too powerful to keep here, so I made more teleportation nuggets here. I saw that. To take us to a new faraway location, you know what to do. I suggest not bringing Milo Jr. this time. Yeah, alright. That doesn't sound very good. Signed, Dr. Edwards Jr. the second. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, I suppose we should go throw the teleportation nugget into water like we always do. Why was I seriously considering throwing the nugget into lava? That would have just destroyed the, that would have just destroyed it. Also, I guess Dr. Edward Jr. II isn't coming either. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yep. As I thought, yeah, no Dr. Edwards Jr. in sight, but there's just this chest. <laughs> there's no sign or anything. Okay, this, these look like the natural disasters he was talking about. Let's have ourselves a look. There's not a lot, but it still looks like a decent amount. Right, let's start with the tsunami bucket. Oh, almost forgot. Some of these actually have crafting recipes, like the tsunami bucket. It's four of any type of fish, four nether stars, and a string. All right, let's put it up top here. Oh, no, that's a terrible idea. Put it down here. Oh God, oh gosh, oh man. Yeah. I I, I think it was a good idea not to put it so high up. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, oh gosh. Okay, this mountain is about to turn into an island. <laughs> okay. This seems like it wasn't the best idea <laughs> at all. Look at this. What? I think it's just going to keep expanding. Okay, well, um, that's a quick and easy way to get an infinite source of water, I guess. Oh, gosh. I'm gonna go away and we're gonna place down the next one, assuming that that's even a good idea. Okay, this is far away enough. <laughs> right, the lava tsunami bucket. 
which is for some reason four wool of any kind, four nether stars, and of course one fire charge. Come to think of it, why was the water one one string? That's a teeny bit random. Alright. Oh, I'm so sorry, village, that I'm not sorry. Oh, man. This is about to... Oh, the lava, the lava and the water are about to collide. Oh, this is what I was worried was going to happen. Oh, gosh. Oh, Lord. Infinite source of... Um, obsidian, I guess. Hurry up, hurry up, lava! The water's gaining on you! Oh, I am terribly sorry, village, that I'm not sorry. Yeah. So, maybe this wasn't such a good idea? Um, I have no clue what Dr. Edwards Jr. II was thinking when he made this. <laughs> I seriously don't know. Oh man, the lava tsunami is flooding through the village and is probably going to destroy everything and everyone. Oh, I'm so sorry, Iron Golem. Again, that I'm not sorry. Eh, so what if I've got a dark side? Most of us have a dark side. At least as far as I'm aware. <laughs> I'm not crazy, right? <laughs> right, now let's... um get away from all of that and you can probably see what we're gonna do next the white paint bucket which doesn't have a crafting recipe so I guess you can only obtain it in creative mode alright so let's place it down and see what happens um I don't think that's supposed to happen alright now, let's try the ice bucket. Huh, that's not too impressive. Let's try the fire fluid bucket. Okay. Pretty much just another kind of lava. So, yes, this pretty much acts like lava. Um, I take it that this is still in development. Because I don't think the textures are supposed to be like that. Like, yeah, like, this mod is definitely not 100% top quality. But, it's still pretty good. Link in the description if you want to try it out. Oh my god, the tsunami. Ah, run away! Run away to cause more havoc! Okay. I'll be with you once I actually find land. Right, so I managed to eventually find land. So next up, we've got the fire bucket. What the? That's the same as the fire fluid bucket. Oh, by the way, uh, ice bucket doesn't have a recipe. Fire fluid bucket doesn't have a recipe. And the fire bucket doesn't have a recipe. Oh my, okay, maybe that's uh, a bit more than the, um, fire fluid bucket. <laughs> um, I think the best thing to do is probably to go to the end dimension. Right, here we are in the end. Can't be bothered to kill the ender dragon. Let's see what the pink paint bucket does. It just turns the block that you right click into a pink paint block. Okay, now we've got the gas bucket. Um, I guess it just works like water. Is this just another tsunami type block? Probably. Now let's do the dark fluid bucket. Oh gosh, so that's pretty much like the lava tsunami. Oh god, oh I'm so sorry Enderman, that I'm not sorry. I wonder what happens when they collide, let's see what happens. Enderman, you are standing in water, jeez. Literally nothing happens. Oh, yes it does. Yep, pretty much just three textured lava and water. 
I'm sure the mod developer will work on it more in the future. I mean, maybe not, maybe they've abandoned it. But still, um, definitely some work needs to be done with this mod. But it's still fun nonetheless, and you should totally check it out. Link in the description. Um, so, yeah. On to the outro. Alright. I hope you enjoyed that mod review. Of course, link in the description if you want to try it yourself. And as you saw, um, it is like, it's pretty much just like, um, it's not the best. Um, hopefully the, the, the hopefully the creator of the mod will update it and make it better because well you saw for some reason the white paint bucket was just placing dirt and the pink paint bucket wa was pretty underwhelming as well um and all the other liquids were pretty much just retextures of the tsunami and the lava tsunami so I give it a 6 out of 10. I don't normally rate mods, but I'm rating this mod. Because why not? Anyways, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. And join my Discord. Link in the description. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye, guys.